just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow old. Please tell me you'll stay or take me away. I want you for myself every single day. You said my world on fire. You said my Hey, B, you wanna help daddy? You wanna help daddy wash the car? Oh. Yeah. All right, we are ready. Let's do it. All right, well, the girls are about to come out, and I am actually gonna start, so I'll wet it down first before I start scrubbing anything, so I'm ready. Let's do it. Good. Good job. All right, got to back up. Sprint. Watch it. Hey, Bobo. Hey. Ella has her little corner. I don't think she's got anything but this side of the, this little corner of the car. She uses her hand and sometimes a towel. You did a good job, Al. You did a good job. Say thank you. You're welcome. She wants to go in the car. Hi, little girl. It looks so much better. It looks so clean. No. Did you have fun? Okay. Have you got an outfit changed? Because I was it fun? Mommy. Did you wash mommy's car? And she said thank you. What do you say? Thank you, mommy. She said that, and then what do you say? Welcome. Welcome. There you go. Eleanor. Ella. Oh, I see you right there, dear. Oh, you're probably play one, two, three, catch with the pillows? Yes. Okay. Bobo, where's Ella? Bobo, where's Ella? Where's your sister? Oh, you want to touch the camera? Yeah. Uh. Ow. Say hi, Bobo. Hi. Oh, oh, all right, all right, no mouth. So it is now like a couple hours later. Ella and Avery are actually both asleep right now. 
Katie's currently upstairs rocking Avery, just kind of holding her and cuddling with her. We like really never record this part of our day, so I was like, oh, why not? I go to the gym, and Katie usually just does whatever, if that's getting ready, or if that's cleaning up, or if that's just hanging out. But um, laundry is almost done. Katie's car wash is done completely. We are off to a good start today. We got a lot done, and it's literally 12. But it's time to go get this work. Let's go. I'm not bringing you guys, actually, so let's not go. I will go, and I will see you when I get back. Oh. Show your hair. Show your hair. Show the camera your hair. Oh, here, turn this way. Let me see you. Please. Show me your hair. Stay. All right, we're going to get a running shot. The action braids, because she's running. Dun, 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 dun. They're so pretty. Good job, Mom. Good job, Mom. Go, 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 go. They are staying intact very well. This is the toddler run test. How well did mom do the braids? So far, so good. We're on lap three. <laughs> hey, you better run faster. I know you can. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Hi guys, you haven't seen much of me today, but here I am. I'm taking you guys with me. I'm actually at Old Navy right now. I've been begging Ben to let me go to Old Navy for so many days now. And finally, I am here. I want to check out their fall and winter stuff. Avi has the sun in her face. Like I've been talking about for the past couple of days, it's already fall here and the girls have no fall clothes. I want to go in there and see if they have anything cute that I want to pick up. I do have a few online orders coming, not from here, but from a few other places. I just have been really wanting to go these past couple of days and I finally convinced Ben to let me go. So as you can hear, I have Avi, but we're going to go in now. Oh my goodness, these past couple of hours have been absolute chaos as our food's about to boil over. I got back from Old Navy and they actually didn't have as much stuff as I thought they were going to have. So I was a little bit disappointed. They had way more stuff online than they did in store. So I may just shop online. I did buy like I think one pair of pants for Ella just to make sure that she is in the size that she is because I would hate to buy a ton of jeans for her and they'd all be like the wrong size so i'm going to make sure that i have the right sizes and then i'm going to go through and buy stuff for them oh so i was a little disappointing oh after that i went grocery shopping with avery and that was a whole mess i got so much stuff my cart was overflowing and it was just me and her she was crying because her passy fell out of her mouth and rolled under like the shelves in walmart and i was like yeah there's no way i'm getting that out because who knows when the last time that was clean so i just kind of left it i couldn't even see it anyway but for the last like 20 minutes of that trip she was crying she cried the whole way home and then she was crying when we got back and i actually forgot formula which i was going to feed her when she got home so i could cook so it was a whole thing now i am attempting to make rice again we'll see how it goes i'll let you guys know and i'm making Alice and mac and cheese because it is almost 6 30 and the girl needs to eat so yeah i'll let you guys know how oh, the rice has like one minute left so let's see oh give it a taste Please. it's not crunchy <laughs> it's They're not, not rice it's not great but it's better than last night oh yeah okay <laughs> you watch it look ready i'll look at her and then i'll hide and she'll peek right out. <laughs> 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 Shake your head. Avery loves when Ella shakes her hair. Look, look, look. <laughs> <laughs> she loves when Ella shakes her hair. Shake. Do it again. <laughs> shake it, shake it. Shake your head. Was it? It was good. Like for me not being hungry. You weren't hungry? No, because I just remember I thought there was a lot of noodles left and I ate that. Like. Oh. So as you can see, Ella took her hair out and 
right after she took her hair out, she put those little tiny elastic hair bands around her wrists. I immediately went over there, very firmly told her that she cannot do that because it was the same exact thing. Like it was caught around her wrist and her hand started to turn purple. It's crazy how fast that is though. Cause like she, that must've been on her wrist for like maybe a minute. A minute. But it's so tight that her wrist just like swells up. All right guys, it is the next day. I forgot that I didn't show you guys any of the stuff that I bought. I went online afterward and saw that some of this stuff was on sale, so I may go back and return them and then buy them online, but I will show you guys what I got. I got Ella this little dress that was on the clearance rack. It was $12, and I figured that she can wear for a little bit some white leggings or like some white biker shorts under this. This is a 12 to 18 month, so I was thinking of this more as like a shirt than a dress. I picked this onesie up for AV. It'll be a perfect thing to wear like in the morning if we're outside and it's still cold. I got Ella some black biker shorts because she only has white ones so I picked her up a pair of black ones. And I got these two pairs of leggings which I am obsessed with. They are so soft and they have these cute little ruffles at the end and this would be so cute like under leggings or anything really so yeah i got it in that color and then also in this gray color and then this outfit i love but i got her this overall dress type thing and i also got this sweater and i think they'd be so cute underneath it because those like match up so that'll be super cute that's all i got i was really hoping there'd be more but I'm glad that I looked online and some of those things, like I said, are priced lower online. So I would definitely, if you're thinking about going shopping, maybe go into store to see like what size your kit is, but buy them online because it was ridiculous, the difference in price. I forgot to mention in this vlog that Ben and I are so sore, like literally so sore. I could barely get down on the ground and film this. I've been trying to stretch out as much as I can, but my... Our legs hurt so bad. It's not just me. Like, his legs hurt so bad, too, and we can't even, like, walk down the stairs. It's hard to, like, carry the kids down the stairs. So, yeah, we're going back to the gym today, and I think we're going to do some arms. I am so excited that I get to, like, share this journey with you guys because I've already gotten a few messages saying, like, oh, you're going to love it or, like, I can't wait to, like, watch and see what happens or you guys have been interested in weightlifting so i'm glad that you guys are like walking this journey with me so we'll see i'm excited for like four to six months down the road to see the difference in my body and the difference in the way that i feel as of right now i'm just sore and i'm actually like been a little bit grumpy because of it like the first day i was so grumpy because I just couldn't stand and I felt so weak and Ben was like, oh, you don't feel good because you feel sore? And I was like, no. Apparently when he's sore, it makes him feel good. When I'm sore, I feel worse. I actually feel like heavier, if that makes sense. Like I feel heavier and like bigger when I'm sore. Like you can't like move around properly. I don't even know how to explain it, but that's how I feel. So I, will, I can't wait until I'm like over this whole soreness thing. But yeah, that is going to be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and follow us on Instagram before you leave, and we will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. You set my world on fire.